Hello guys, welcome to my video series. I'll be putting you through how to create some Android gradient background. So let's start by creating a new project. So let's select an empty activity next. Gradient background. So then you click on finish, ensure Java or Kotlin is selected, and then click on finish. So to set up our project, Okay, now our project has finished loading. Let's start. So the first step is to um, define our colors. So you come to RES, that's for resources. Then you come to values. Then you double click on colors. So we declare our colors. So let's give it let's give it a blue color. So the ending color, let's give it a purple color. Six D D seven. Okay, so after declaring the color, then the next process is to um, create the gradient background. So you come to your drawable folder, then you, do, um, you right click, select new, drawable resource file. So let's call it a background, one background. So you click OK. So now, since we are um, creating a gradient, let's change this to shape. Then we'll create a gradient. So you put the start color. So let's select our blue. So you put the ending color, end color. Let's select purple. And then you select the angle. So for the angle, you can't just put any value like one. It won't work. So the values you need to put needs to be in multiples of 45. That's you start from zero. Zero means it will start from the left to the right. Then 45. It should be a multiple of 45. That's from the um, bottom to the top 90 that's from the top right to the to from the bottom right from the bottom left to the top right so you move just like that 135 if you go 136 it won't work so from 135 you move to 180 and that's now so 2025 Two to five. So I think this is okay for us. So basically, this is we've created the gradient. Then we need to include it to our layout. You come to your main activity. So you open the preview here. This is our preview. You delete the text again. Then you change the background. I draw into the own background. So 
that's all for today guys subscribe to my channel so now you can start putting your your buttons and other components so thanks for watching my video guys subscribe